Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm Dave Shaves. Today we are continuing our work through the Rockwell 6C. Today we are doing plate five and doing it on about a week or so of growth. I've been waiting a week because I really wanted to see how well the five does with that much growth. So we're really gonna get a good test, I think. And also, frankly, I just have not had the time to keep up. Uh, day jobs been keeping me busy. Um, so once a week for a little while is gonna be all I can really manage right now. That's not to say I'm not doing work on the channel. I am just doing a lot of behind the scenes stuff. Uh, recently, been working on some logos for myself, as well as uh, a business structure for what I have planned in the pipeline for the channel, the brand, etc. That will be coming later. Not much to say right now, but if anything develops, I will let you know. Until then, uh, let's go on with today's shave, which again is going to be the Rockwell 6C on plate five. Uh, loaded in there is the Feather new high stainless blade. And for shave cream, we're going to be using Parasso Green, lathering with my old original Badger Hair Brush, and finishing up with Parasso Green Aftershave. So that is what we are doing today. Let's get this party started. Let's go ahead and splash some hot water on my face. Don't need much as I just got out of the shower, so we should be pretty good. All right, pretty well hydrated there. Let's go ahead and take the brush, put a little bit of shave cream on the brush. Take my trusty old Viking blade bowl and let's get lathering. So yeah, I've been doing a lot of behind the scenes stuff, trying to just doing a lot of thinking, mainly it's just ideas video ideas, things like that, logos, stuff like that. Uh, really trying to grow the brand here. Um, once I have some more time, then I'll really be able to start diving into things that I wanted to, to do. I do have a lot of ideas, not just with videos, but with things in general. Um, not much to say right now. Once things materialize, I will say more. But until then, that's going to keep things a little quiet and see what happens. I do want to take the opportunity though, while I'm talking about this to thank a couple of friends, uh, a couple of friends that have given me their ideas and pointers on the logos that I've created. And those friends specifically are uh, David Sperling, and Samantha Bates, my two best friends in the world. I've been asking their opinions and some of them probably get, some of them, there's only two of them. Uh, both of them probably get tired of, of hearing about it on occasion, I'm sure. I tend to be a broken record and when I get talking about something, sometimes I send a million messages and I don't always let up. So I appreciate them putting up with me uh, when I'm passionate about something, it's kind of what happens. Lathering is going really well. Hope everybody's doing well right now in the world. Um, I know that the virus is still looming its ugly head, specifically here in the States. Have a lot of flare-ups all over. Seems like other countries are faring much better than we are. But hopefully we can get it under control soon. But in the interim, I am back at work. 
working for the new company. It's going really well, really well, really much, very much enjoying it. And it's good. So that is that. Not much else to say. Like I said, I've not had as much time as I'd like to, to devote to the channel. I know I said last week that I was hoping to have more time, and I was. I was planning on doing more, and eventually I will. But right now, all I can really focus on is just the, the behind-the-scenes stuff. Focusing on in front of the camera is a little difficult right now, uh, just with... Timing and everything else. So I hope you all forgive me. I haven't even been able to really get a whole lot of shave time in in general, which is another reason, to be honest, why I waited a week between shaves, because. I just get so busy even in the evenings that shaving itself is not always an easy thing to squeeze in. And I don't like shaving in the mornings. I don't know. It's a thing. I shave only in the evenings. Partly because in the mornings I feel rushed. In the evenings I definitely have more time. And when I shave, I really like to enjoy it. I don't want it to become a chore. It's the whole point of moving forward, trying to do stuff with this is because I enjoy shaving. And if I make it a chore, it's not gonna be quite as fun. All right, let's go ahead and see how well this does. I'm wondering how many paths I need to, need to do with plate five. We'll see. I realize I started with the bottom, which is different for me. Usually I start on top. But. I could say it was done on purpose, but really I was just talking and just started where I wanted to start. So consider it a little treat for you guys, a little switch. I don't know if you even notice the directions of which I shave or the order. But if you do, we'll call it a shave up, uh, switch up. Shave up, that works too. All right, going over the top. One thing I have noticed, though, unfortunately, is the uh, cost of health insurance in the private market. I haven't had to worry about that in a while because I've had jobs for the past few years that have covered it. But leaving my last job and going into this one, I'm now working for a company that isn't big enough to offer its employees benefits. Not say he doesn't want to, but he only has two employees and a part time employee, none of which need insurance other than myself. So it's not something he offers right now. And unfortunately, I'm noticing on the private market, it's very expensive. I'm not trying to get political here. I'm just stating a fact. I'm not trying to make anybody uncomfortable or alienate based on politics. I'm just stating a fact that it's expensive. I'm not going to go into why I think that might be or the causes, reasons, etc. But it's just something that I have noticed.
specifically today, because on the on the in the marketplace, which for those that don't know, is the uh, where you can buy like official what's referred to as ACA, what was part of the ACA um, policies. And the ACA was the Affordable Care Act that was created a number of years back. Um, and the marketplace is the uh, the government-run website where you can purchase a lot of these ACA policies. And that's just for people that live in other countries. I'm not going to go into all the rest of the details. But uh, anyway... My point is, on the marketplace today, it was looking at a policy, and for what's available on there right now, it's almost 400 bucks for not much. All right, before I continue, uh, looking this over real quick. Let's touch this up. Um, one pass actually could probably do it, but I'll go in and go for pass two and we'll see how it does. Maybe pass three after that, but probably only pass two. Anyway, um, for my health insurance to get coverage, that's really not good. Um, it's 400 bucks a month. Now. There's a continuation of my old benefits, which is what's called a uh, COBRA uh, here in the United States for people that have lost their insurance to do change of jobs or whatnot. Um, and for those that don't know, we do not have standardized uh, government run healthcare here in the United States. It's all pretty much private. Um, which is why it is as expensive as it is. Again, not political, just stating facts. Um, but anyway, the COBRA, which is a continuation of my previous coverage through my last employer, is fantastic coverage. Absolutely fantastic. But it is 500 bucks a month. It's only 100 bucks more than what I'd be doing on the marketplace for significantly less coverage. So that's what I'm looking at right now. But, and again, uh, if you shut off because I'm talking about this, I apologize. It is not my intention to alienate people and I'm really not trying to get political. So if these comments are coming off political, I do apologize. I I'm just talking about what's going on in my life. So that's, that's it. Um, on to other topics. The Razer is doing really well. I'm really loving Plate 5. So if you if you have your Rockwell 6C and you go a week, Plate 5 is the way to go. And I am definitely not going to need any more than two passes. Luckily, One positive note that I have to offer right now. Is that since leaving my previous job, my mental health has been a little bit better. I have my, my ups and downs, but with anxiety and depression, Unfortunately, it's not just as simple as getting out of the situation, 
but it's, it has been, the anxiety aspect has been better. Depression comes and goes, but less anxious. If any of you are suffering from depression or anxiety and need someone to talk to, please let me know. I'm always here to listen. Okay. Definitely two passes is all we need. Now, part of that is, of course, the razor. The other part of that is the fact that the feather is an extremely sharp but extremely efficient blade. I really like it. Give everything a rinse off. That's that. It's like I went over, I think I went over an irritated area over here. There was a little bit of blood. So I'm just gonna use my styptic pencil, touch up a little bit. I don't necessarily think that was a cut just went over something. Nothing. Styptic pencil won't take care of. Just a little bit over here too. Sometimes I put the styptic pencil just all over my neck because I feel that it helps with irritation. So, okay, um, let's go ahead and splash some Parasso Green aftershave on my face. All right, very nice. As always, not much burning, maybe a little bit on my neck, but that's to be expected. I have very sensitive skin on my neck, as I probably mentioned, but beyond that, very good. Nice shave, good aftershave, that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope I didn't put too many of you off by my comments about healthcare in the middle. Um, please, stay, please stay tuned for other videos. You will be getting another shaving with video coming shortly. That's gonna be shaving with bar soap. After that is probably going to be shaving with uh, petroleum jelly and or what's uh, brand name Vaseline. Got a couple other ideas in the pipeline as well, as well as numerous other products to try. So. That said, of course, as always, if you're watching this video and you have not yet, please hit that subscribe button. Also, down below are all my social media handles. Please click on there. Give me a follow, a like, a subscribe, everything, just so you can stay up to date with all of my goings on. <laughs> if you like this video, you like all my videos, hit that like button, give me a comment below. Until next time, Stay happy, stay happy. I keep mixing that up. I don't know what is with me. Let's try that again, shall we? From the top. Stay happy, stay healthy, and keep shaving. I will see you on the next video. Thanks, guys.